There's tons of videos out there that show you how to create meta business page ads or Facebook ads with a hyperlink. But any image that I found on how to do a free hyperlink on the meta business suite or Facebook, it doesn't work anymore. I've tried it and I can't get any uploads. So today I'm gonna to show you how you can get some organic reach just using your phone and make a hyperlinked picture, whatever picture you want. Now take this video with a grain of salt. This is not a Facebook ad. This is something where you're going in and you're altering a Facebook ad. If you've already seen these videos, you can probably just click off now. If it's something new to you, keep on watching. Here we are in the ad center. I'm gonna go ahead and click that and I'm gonna create a new ad. So I'm gonna create an ad and I can use any picture I would like. Yeah, automatic. Um, actually, I do want more website visitors. The way I make it, so it's mine. Bookmark that I want. I'm gonna go ahead, choose my button and I want the book now button. Okay, and there we go. All that is good. I go up here and save. But now I do want to change this. So I want to edit the media. I want to edit my image. I'm going to edit media. And yes, wonderful pictures of Pepper, the princess. But I'm going to go to edit images. And I want to go down here to the camera roll because I have some cool pictures of Pepper's friends. Oh, and here's one of Pepper's friends. And I want to use Lola. Lola is now going to be my call, of call to action. So there's Lola. She's a beauty, isn't she? So now I've chosen Pepper's friend's picture. I've made a call to action, share your pup's pick, and I'm gonna go ahead and save changes. And now I can pick my ad. Because I'm gonna do this for free, I'm just gonna do the advantage plus creative and promote now. It's gonna go through this for just a second. And then I'm gonna turn this off and pause it and show you how you can still share your ad. And there it goes. It's in review. And let's see what's gonna happen when it comes out of review. So here I am in my ad center. I can preview the ad and it is not running yet. But I just in case I missed it or got distracted, I set for a very low bar of just a dollar a day. And there's Pepper's friend Lola. And now I'm gonna go ahead and pause it. Yes, I want to pause. Here's where the magic starts. Okay, I'm gonna hit back. And now I'm gonna go down here and you see my other videos, I like to keep things simple. Hit the three dots. I can either resume the ad or view the ad. I'm gonna view the ad. From here, viewing the ad, it still has the hyperlink. If I click on it, it takes me to the website. So now I can check availability, I can book now. But the other thing I can do, I can share. So now that I can share, I can say whatever I would like, but Keep it simple, just share now. And that is posting back to my site. And of course, it wants me to boost the post, but not now. Um, one of the things I like to do, so if I am going to share, do the share now, and then do a call to action. Share your pet's photo. Tag somebody who needs a vacation. So let's tag somebody, because my product is really a vacation rental. So if you have a product or service, tag someone who needs your product or service. Somebody might need tax help. Somebody might need their gutters cleaned or their lawn mowed. You never know what it's gonna be, but tag someone who needs your help and then share, and you will have double call to action because you have that hyperlink on there. So the book now is still there and you have another call to action so it's organically being shared across your friends group and subscribers to your business page so there you go in about three minutes you can be posting any photo that's on your photo or camera roll or that you scrape off the internet onto your meta business page or your facebook posts it's just that you're going to have to go through these extra steps to make it a hyperlinked picture I've tried any image.io. I can't get it to work. If it works for you, that's awesome. It's an easy way to go. There's lots of videos about it. This way, you're uploading a new image, you're boosting the post, you're turning the boost off, and then you're resharing that image. Click on the dot, 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 view image, and then share. Make sure you do a call to action, so that way you get the most traction, most reach with that post after you turn the boost off. Thanks, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.